Hi, my name is Jimmy Ravitas, General Manager of FAF Tuning, and today we're at sunny Canadian Tire Motorsport Park to take our latest build, the 911 GT3 Alternative, around the track. This car came to fruition through the collective minds of FAF Tuning getting together, having a discussion about the latest GT3 coming out. What's everybody complaining about? No manual box, PDK, nobody likes it. So what we decided to do is take a 911 Carrera S, outfit it with Porsche's factory power kit, outfit it with a standard manual gearbox, and of course look to our partners to put this beautiful package together. So what we've done is so we've worked with, we worked the car from top to bottom, I'll start with the suspension. We looked to our technical partners at Bilstein and installed PSS 10 coilovers with full PASM control on the car. So we're able to corner balance the vehicle through ride height and of course get the shocks dialed in just right. And of course you get a little versatility for road use if you want it to be a little bit more comfortable. From there of course rolling stock. We looked to forge line for a nice lightweight monoblock wheel and of course complemented that with a Trofeo R tire from Pirelli. Fantastic grip. Uh, moving on from there, Tech Art Aero Kit, which reduces air getting underneath the vehicle and adding a little bit more downforce. And of course, complementing the beautiful look of this car, also features a center exit exhaust, just like the GT3. And that's also fully controlled through the sport exhaust option in the center console on this piece. Moving on from there, adding a little bit more safety to the car, we look at GMG for their half cage paint that's the same color as the vehicle. And of course, remove the rear seats and take a little weight out of the car. You know, everybody's been talking, what are we going to do, everybody in the group, how fast is this car going to go on our race, around our racetrack? You know, a lot of GT3s out there with competent drivers are in the sub 130. So we invited our resident driver, Chris Green, from Montreal to take this car around the track and rip it up. Today I had the opportunity to hop out in this uh, brand new 2014 911 GT3 Alternative. It's a uh, Porsche that fact tuning has put together uh, basically to allow the true purists uh, that have always been hoping for a manual transmission in the new 991 uh, GT3 streetcar to have the ability to change gears, a seven gear transmission manual in this car, whereas that will be an option that won't be available unfortunately on the new release of the 911 GT3. So today we're here at uh, Canadian Tire Motorsports Park. I've been uh, beating around the racetrack in this thing today and I have to say it is awesome. Um, I mean, apart from the beautiful body kit and the aesthetics that they've done to this car, I mean, just going as deep as changing the shocks, putting Bilski and TSS 10s in here, um, the Pirelli Trofeos are fantastic. I mean, the car was really dialed in in the corners. Um, I mean, just the fact to be able to go back to a original manual transmission which is something that I haven't been able to do on a performance car in such a long time was really more of a nostalgic moment for me today um, I was really excited about uh, just you know being able to flip the throttle again and get the car from fifth to third or hard braking coming into turn five and uh, just kind of going through the motions of an H pattern gearbox um, apart from that today I mean I, this was really my first opportunity to drive anything but a 911 GT3 Cup car in the new 991 format. And I must say this car is absolutely fantastic. So much grip, 
Uh, the car just wants to hug the track. It can point it wherever you need it to be. I mean, I had all the driver aids off of the car. I was able to just get a perfect amount of rotation into it to allow it to actually go out and uh, make this into a sub-130 car here at the Canadian Tire Motorsports Park.